Just like that, filmed right here in Charleston, the movie Only God Can explores the lifetime bond of five friends struggling through life's challenges. The film premieres tonight at the Terrace Theater. Executive producer Linda Flannery, along with Donna D'Erico, is joining us with the details uh, and also a chance that you can win four tickets. Tell us what this movie is about and how it has been involving over the last couple of years, filmed actually uh, out at Kiowa, where exactly where you live. Yes, um, well the movie was filmed in Kiowa. We did uh, most of the filming here in Charleston, a little bit in Greenville, mm -hmm. but it is about five women that went to the College of Charleston and, you know, they get together uh, for a reunion mm -hmm. and they have been for 20 years and the movie mm -hmm. just kind of depicts their life and their bond together and the issues and kind of, you know, the problems that these women, mm -hmm. you know, have. They're very realistic problems. The relationship of the women is very real. And um, there's a faith aspect to it that, you know, to overcome your issues, it's mm -hmm. anything is possible with God. Mm -hmm. So. And, and, and Donna, That's these, basically the message. Yeah, yeah. And, the whole and, and, and Donna, mm -hmm. these women, all friends from the College of Charleston, That's all graduated right. College of Charleston, uh, they've grown up over the years. That's right. But now there, there's alcohol. There's maybe some substance. There's divorce. There's right. you know, no telling all kinds what of else. Things. Stuff Infidelities. That everybody goes through. Right. Or yeah. a every, lot of every, go through. That's exactly a good point, Tom. Yeah. Is that there's there's enough of these characters and they're so diverse in their mm -hmm. problems that people are going to be able to relate to mm -hmm. something in mm -hmm. the movie to somebody's problem or sure. issue in the movie and mm -hmm. ultimately the whole you know moral of the movie at the end is that like Linda said mm -hmm. God can get you through mm -hmm. really even the the toughest problems that's and no lie that's for sure yeah <laughs> that's for sure it helps you tremendously from uh, going through a divorce a number that's of years ago that's absolutely yeah. right yeah. yeah I I mean I've I've been a, a Christian. I've mm -hmm. been very faithful mm -hmm. my whole life since I was baptized mm -hmm. as a baby like uh -huh. all of us were. But mm -hmm. um, I really turned back to the church mm -hmm. after leading kind of a, a somewhat mm -hmm. sinful life for a little while there mm -hmm. when I fell away from the church. Sure. And I returned to it when I started going through a mm -hmm. divorce about eight years ago, nine years ago. Mm -hmm. And I've never looked back. And Good that's why you. I really embraced this mm -hmm. character because mm -hmm. um, I've never gotten to play a character mm -hmm. like this. Mm -hmm. I'm always cast as something different. Mm -hmm. And, and this character is, is, is so, well, mm -hmm. she's an alcoholic. I play yes. an alcoholic mm -hmm. with a lot of other kinds of problems, but mm -hmm. you know, you'll see what happens in the end. I won't mm -hmm. give it away, but it's, it's a really uplifting story and I, I enjoyed it. And this movie's playing at the Terrace tonight at seven o'clock and 7.15. That's right. Uh, fortunate for those who got tickets because mm -hmm. it is now sold out, but Both we have is. a giveaway. We're gonna tell you about that in just a moment. Yeah. But uh, you know, with, with this film, hopefully the Terrace will see uh, deep down in their heart that they could show it a couple more times and let people know about that so that they can cut so individuals can get tickets yeah. but it, uh, it is scheduled mm -hmm. um, three more showings at the terrace okay. and we have uh, three showings in Mount Pleasant as mm -hmm. well and well, they must have heard me just talking about <laughs> that. Uh, right back up. Yeah. yeah just go to our website <clears throat> uh -huh. only God can movie and mm -hmm. um, you can get mm -hmm. tickets to any of the mm -hmm. shows that are still you know available uh -huh. we also can set up screenings for churches and things like that okay. which is what we're doing and we just had a uh, one in Greenville last night mm -hmm. uh, that sold out as well um, a church and um, it it was great mm -hmm. yeah it's doing really well it sounds like it is tell us about this red carpet that's going on tonight this is good that's gonna be fabulous it's gonna be very exciting yeah. um, you know we will have press coverage lots of people I'll um, be there there's Donna. another main cast member that's gonna Vanessa be there Abigan. Too. Vanessa okay. Abigan. yeah because yeah, we've got uh, Lisa Sheridan is, is in the film of course Donna you're in that and yeah. also Robbie Chong yes Robbie um, Chong and Vanessa and mm -hmm. Greg Evigan yeah so you guys have pulled out all the stops bringing some folks in from Hollywood yeah. and all yes. over uh, yeah. for this filming uh, tell us you know what was it like doing this movie because you're portraying a woman who's an alcoholic yeah. and and you're really trying to to uh, allow the viewer and the listener to see and to almost put themselves right in your place right. with what's going on. Right. It, it was, um, you know, it took some doing to mm -hmm. get into to that frame of mind because I don't mm -hmm. actually really drink in real life. Okay. But I have had a lot of experience <laughs> yeah. with alcoholics uh -huh. and alcoholism and so I was able to pull from that mm -hmm. and... Um, you play though an alcoholic very well. Thank Just you. So you know. <laughs> <laughs> but does. you know, you're right. People are going to be able to relate mm -hmm. to it because either themselves, you know, yeah. being 
maybe mm -hmm. having a problem with alcohol or somebody that they know mm -hmm. or, or love dealing with it and it's hard either way right and so um, I, I really hope that people are able mm -hmm. to to tap into some of that mm -hmm. when they watch the movie so Linda you being the executive producer you're seeing and working with a, a, a lady who doesn't drink doesn't mm -hmm. drink alcohol playing an alcoholic how do you how do you pull that out and then bring in the the spiritual being as well with not not only Donna but the, the other ladies as well well the interesting thing is first of all they're all really talented actors and um, it's all about emotion I think and getting into your role um, two of the uh, individuals Greg Evigan and Vanessa have been rebaptized since doing this. So this movie has wow. had a profound effect mm -hmm. on, on all many of us. people, yeah. yeah. We are all very close. Um, I, I mean, I see Donna when I go out to LA, mm -hmm. which is fairly frequently. Mm -hmm. I see Lisa. I watch the Super Bowl at Greg's house. So mm -hmm. we all are still very connected. Um, the movie had a really special effect on us, and I do think it's the faith aspect. And, um, and it's having an effect on the audiences that are coming to is. watch it. They're, they're saying yeah. a lot of the same things. I can't tell you how many people come up and say, you know, I can totally relate to this character, oh, sure. Sure. and this helped me. Mm -hmm. um, and, and that's really what we want to, mm -hmm. you know, try to do, is, is if we can reach one person mm -hmm. um, and give them the help. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure exactly. there's, you've already done that with, with a number of people. Yeah. Uh, only God, uh, let's see, onlygodcanmove.com. Check go out on that website. Uh, again, the uh, 7 o'clock and 7.15 shows are sold out, but we've got three more shows, and it's also coming over to the Mount Pleasant area. Ladies, it's been a pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank, Thank you, you so very much. Hey, we've got a giveaway to tell you about as well. It'd be the first caller at 849-2535 for your chance to win tickets to tonight's premiere of Only God Can at the Terrace Theater. It's sold out, but we've got four tickets for you to enter. You must be 18 years of age, uh, live within the ABC News 4 viewing area, and the total value is $44. See official contest rules at abcnews4.com. That number again, 849-2535. We're back in just a moment.